Millions of people were focused on Washington for the inauguration after issues at the nation's capital just two weeks ago. Well, Tucson police were also keeping a close eye here at home just in case there were any problems. News for Tucson's Lapita Maria was with some of those officers who were keeping the peace. As the 46th president of the United States was taking his oath of office in Washington, D.C., here in Tucson, police were upholding the citizens' right to free speech. Their First Amendment right is critical, and that's one of the founding things for our democracy. So um, being able to honor that and to be able to protect that is something the Tucson Police Department takes seriously. Lieutenant Tim Reese was at this downtown demonstration where protesters covered a myriad of topics. Part of it had to do with uh, racial justice, and there were some Black Lives Matter um, comments uh, that were made. But then additionally, it, it looks like there's additional topics out there. Such as wearing masks to keep COVID from spreading, abolishing the two-party system. Lieutenant Belinda Morales was patrolling the surrounding area and checking with motorcycle units and officers who were walking the beat. Troopers with the Arizona Department of Public Safety were also placed in strategic locations around the area. So we want those people set in place in the event something does happen. We're able to quickly respond to those incidents. We're able to de-escalate that so nothing further happens. During this inauguration week, Tucson Police has made it a priority to look in on offices like this one as well as on elected officials. To ensure that our elected officials are protected, their places of business and areas or hours of operation are also being looked at to ensure that there are no problems at those locations. So far, everything's been peaceful, but in the event that things go the opposite way, Tucson police say they're prepared. We've got you covered from downtown. Lupita Murillo, News for Tucson.